Hi guys, I'm Shmi150. We're back in London after this year's Gumball 3000 Supercar Rally, which was absolutely epic. But I just wanted to say a quick thank you because we've reached a rather special achievement. The Shmi150 video coverage from this year's rally has just cleared two and a half million video views. So thank you to every single one of you who have watched it, followed it, subscribed to the Shmi150 channel and just generally been involved. It's been amazing being there and being able to bring this content to you. But what I wanted to do now was just take a look back at some of the highlights of this year's rally, some of the best things I saw and places we went. I mean, the whole thing, without a doubt, starting in Copenhagen, you've got some amazing people, some amazing cars, and you know you're going to some amazing places. But it all really kicks off when I first walked into Raccoon Vehicle Wrapping to take a look at some of the cars. They're getting ready and prepared, getting wrapped, stickers being put on and lined up for this year. Of course, after Raccoon though, the cars head out onto the grid. This year's grid set out based on cars and drivers making donations to the Gumball Foundation, set up this year to obviously help people out and uh, make it a little bit more fun for the Gumballers as well. So the cars pulled up, lined up, beautiful day when the cars were being uh, set up there. start day then and it absolutely downpoured in Copenhagen. The cars obviously all decorated up with contour cameras sponsoring the event but uh, it was not so good for me. I got absolutely soaked filming it. Had a lot of fun though, that's the most important thing and saw all of the cars off on their way. <laughs> We then ran back to my car, jumped in, and off we went for our 3,000 miles. favourite moment for this year's rally has to have been at Premier Park in Finland when Josh of House Car 2, he put his Ferrari F12 and his Rolls Royce Phantom right next to each other, hopped in his Novatec 458 Spider and drifted round them. <laughs> What a rally, the effort some teams went to and the cars they brought. Ewan Olsen, Team Betsafe, he brought his Rebellion. Pretty hardcore way to travel the 3,000 Gumball miles. <laughs> Obviously we had the incinerator setting off at the front of the grid. Pretty wild custom car. But the spirit of the Gumball went, I think rightly so, to Team Galag. They brought a Batmobile Tumbler and even custom built their TG1 supercar. You can't really do more than that for a supercar rally. I think of all the places we went to, my favourite that really stands out, I mean everywhere was absolutely crazy in its own way, but the most wild was by far Poland. The crowds and support in Poland was absolutely incredible. You guys are amazing. We, um, the, just the way people crowded around, cheered, supported, wanted stickers, just went absolutely wild. Every single place the gumballers went was incredible. 
Poland though it was into Austria where the police did not like us. Any opportunity the Austrian police could find to pull over gumball cars they did. It's probably quite funny looking back on it, back on it now but it was so frustrating at the time getting pulled over for anything. Anyway we made it through and on to Monaco the final destination for the 2013 gumball 3000. into words quite what it's like when you arrive at the end. It's the sense of satisfaction, how happy and relieved you are, you know the cars have made it, the people have made it, everyone's there, you've all been through the same ridiculous adventure that you'll probably never repeat in your life. But yes, you're there, you're Monaco, the Grand Prix weekend is ahead of you, pretty good feeling. <laughs> So yeah, a quick shout out to the other sponsors of Gumball. You've got CNI, you've got Twisted Defenders. Tony Hawk was traveling in one of those. And of course, for me, Shmi150, I spent a lot of time filming the House Car 2 guys. That was a lot of fun. Thank you to them for going so crazy and making the content so worthwhile. My Shmi150 hour long movie was live just after the rally. So I think that was a pretty good way to see what it all entails straight off. So yeah. Thanks for watching. Um, looking forward already to 2014. We don't quite know what's in store, but all we know is it's going to be absolutely amazing. Two and a half million views, though, that's going to be hard to beat. Well, who knows? Let's see what the rally holds in store for us. So make sure you subscribe, of course, to my Shmi150 channel and check out the Gumball 3000 channel itself for a few more clips from this year and years to come. I'll catch up with you again soon. Cheers. We're in Copenhagen in Denmark for the start of the 2013 Gumball 3000 Supercar Rally.